All right, friends, here we go. This is our storm system that everybody's talking about because today's weather is pretty benign, let's be honest. Uh, low pressure system in the northwest today will slide off to the southeast and then it's expected to curl under us. This is an upper level system that's actually merging with a second system as it, as it rolls in here. And the exact path of this storm through Saturday uh, will determine where the snow falls and how much we get in our area. Okay, so that's big and the timing is important too and that will be adjusted I sense between today and tomorrow. So today nice and quiet, not quite as warm as yesterday, but still a very pleasant January day 51 the high. Uh, we'll call that cool but dry uh, after we got through some showers this morning and then 40 degrees tomorrow under cloudy skies, a colder day and it stays dry through three o'clock, just cloudy and colder. After that, things start to change. Here's the super predictor starting at three o'clock and we see the snow moving in from the northwest and sliding into the area through the evening commute. Now temperatures should remain above freezing until maybe two or three in the morning. The ground's pretty warm from the warm days we had over the past few days. So even if it is snowing, I don't think it's snowing hard enough that it overcomes the warm atmosphere and the warm roads. So you'll, you may see some snow on the drive home tomorrow, but I don't think it's going to be accumulating on the roads. Uh, but certainly through the rest of the evening, overnight Friday night into Saturday morning, we'll see some accumulating snowfall across the area. Now, it looks as though it shuts down pretty early in the day for most of us, but again, the exact path of that low to our south is going to determine whether or not it continues to snow in the southern counties, okay, and how much you get. Right now, we think it's going to end pretty soon in the day. So this is the latest computer projection on the snowfall from Friday night through Saturday afternoon. This is total snowfall. And the area is in blue here, two to four. I would say a pocket of five inches is certainly possible in some of these areas. Uh, and you can see outside of that, maybe one to two inches uh, across the area. So uh, pretty significant snowfall coming for Saturday morning, and there will be some snow on the ground, and untreated roads will be a little slick, it appears, on Saturday morning. So 40 degrees uh, on Friday for the high with that afternoon, evening snowfall or mix starting and then extending through Friday night into Saturday when it's just snow. 33 degrees for the high, so it certainly will have an opportunity to stick, especially on grassy areas. A very cold day on Sunday, a very cold morning, 16 degrees with snow on the ground. 30 for the high on Sunday. Started to turn a little around a little bit. The kids will have the day off on Monday for Martin Luther King Jr. Day. And then back to the mid-40s briefly on Tuesday. Another slight chance of snow at this point. Doesn't look like a big deal on Thursday next week.